Welcome to the Tool Review Channel. Today we are taking a look at the Klein Tools 327-68 3-in-1 Impact Flip Socket. Now if you've seen my previous video where I reviewed the 7-in-1 uh, Flip Band Pack Socket, these are basically kind of the same, but they only come with two different sizes. You have the quarter inch and your 5 sixteenths. Um, so to start off the video here, we'll take a look at the 3 inch size bit right here. As you can see, you have your socket up here, and it is the labeled quarter inch. And then on the bottom, you got the 5 sixteenths right there as well. And then you have the Klein Tools name. I believe it is all laser etched onto the surface. And then you also have the color indicator, so you can tell the difference between each size. And then here is the product number for this guy. It is 32766. And you have the Klein Tools name uh, laser etched onto there as well. And then if you flip it over, you have a lot, some safety warnings in H6. And then you have the patent pending as well. So now you're probably looking at this and thinking, okay, so it is... I see two sockets. Where is the third socket or the third use of this tool? And that is actually uh, right here. So what you do is you pop this tool. You can take this tool apart as you can see right there and you have the basically the shaft of the tool and then you have your little flip socket right there as you can see it is a nice six point design right there and then you got quarter inch side right there as well and basically the third function of these sockets is obviously it acts as kind of a quarter inch um bit holder so all you have to do is pop it up and you can see there's a little quarter inch bit um that shows right there and then all you have to do is bring in your little quarter inch bit right here and you just put it into there and as you can see it locks into place and it's a fairly strong little magnet on the inside right there and you can obviously easily pull it out and then if you needed to you can flip around the socket right there uh snap it in and then you have the quarter inch bit right there as well so if you are using a little quarter inch or five sixteenths uh, screw obviously that's going to be your 5 16 size there's got a 5 16 self tapper right there so the magnet is pretty decent uh, for holding those in and then if you obviously have a quarter inch bit you can flip this guy around right there and make sure it is all the way down uh, so that the way the magnet will hold your little screw right there and as you can see it does a fairly decent job holding on to those screws so this is the three inch uh, size bit um, so we'll go ahead and put that guy together and then we'll take a look at the five inch bit. It's basically the same thing, but the product number is three, two, seven, six, seven. And like I said, the set, um, these come in a, basically a little set. You get the three inch and the five inch. Uh, and I, like I said, the set number is three, two, seven, six, eight. Now I found these kind of interesting. Um, I kind of feel like Klein is starting to go after, um, the truck, the, tested and proven Melco nut drivers that are out there because you can see this is Klein's version of their uh, nut driver we'll go ahead and bring in some Melco ones right here so as you can see these are um, all of the quarter inch 5 16 Melco nut drivers uh, that are out there so kind of looks like uh, Klein is trying to get their foot in the door and go head to head with these uh, Melco uh, nut drivers you can see kind of almost compares to the longer version of it. I believe this is a six inch bit. And then you have like a four and a half inch bit right here. So it's a little bit shorter than Klein's five inch bit. And then you obviously have your two and a half inch bit and then your two inch a uh, little bit right here as well. And they work pretty much the same as the Klein bits. Um, we gotta pull it off here. As you can see, you just pull it off and you flip it around. Uh, and Melco has had a few different variations of this tool. Um, they did come out and redo the head to slim it down a little bit so you can get it into a tighter space. Um, and now they obviously have four different sizes of the tool, whereas Klein only has two different sizes of their uh, nut driver uh, as of making this video. Um, so that's kind of... Um, kind of felt like I should give these a try and see how they work because I love using these. I use them on a daily basis and as you can see they've uh, seen some better days. You know they come in handy. Uh, the quarter inch and the five sixteenths come in handy when you are if you're either installing or and or doing service on a furnace um, especially when it comes to pulling the flame sensor to clean that you just use the longer quarter inch bit uh, and you can just get on that screw and pull it out no problem or it is nice to use some of the smaller size bit if you're having to pull out burners on let's say a goodman furnace where they are held in by two screws or some some of the lennox furnaces out there have the flame sensor where you have to go it's kind of awkward to get to because they put the flame sensor behind um the exhaust pipe uh for the furnace so you kind of have to get back there with like a right angle bit and get it up there try to get it out so you can clean the flame sensor so definitely if you're in the um the heating and air uh, industry like i am you're definitely going to be using quarter inch and five sixteenths pretty much on a daily basis regardless if you're working on a furnace or if you're working on the ac unit outside 
They are nine times out of 10 held together by quarter inch and or 5 16 screws. So definitely going to give these um, nut drivers a try from Klein Tools. Uh, figured they looked quite interesting and figured I'd go ahead and try them out and see how they compare to the Melco ones since I have all, pretty much off all of the Melco ones that are available. As you saw, I have all the quarter inch 5 16 I also have a couple of the 5 16 3 8 ones as well. Um, and I use that one. I don't use that one as much as the quarter inch and the 5 16 bits, but it does come in handy. So it will be interesting to see if Klein comes out with their version of a quarter inch and a 3 8 uh, um, nut driver in the future. Um, but that's pretty much it for this video. So I figured I would show you this, uh, show you this new product from Klein Tools. Uh, I will leave a link to the product page in the description below if you would like to learn more and or pick this setup for yourself. Now, I am interested to see if Klein will just release uh, the individuals uh, by themselves since they do have their own little product number on them. It's not just the product number that the uh, kit comes in or the set comes in. So it will be interesting to see, like just like the Malco ones, if they start offering different sizes and they start selling the different sizes by themselves. Um, but that's really about it for this video. So if you have any questions, comments, concerns, please feel free to leave them down in the comment section below. And if you are new to the channel and you want to see more content like this, please consider hitting that subscribe button. But that's all I have. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for the next video to be uploaded.